What comes to mind when you think of Switzerland? Is it the majestic Swiss Alps and the quaint country settings? Or is it the unique French, German, and Italian cultural influences? Maybe it's the historic castles and heritage. Whatever it is, Switzerland has something special for you. Whether your idea of the perfect vacation is hiking in a world of breathtaking vistas or exploring the roots of your faith. We are going to experience just a sampling of all Switzerland has to offer by exploring Bern, Lucerne, and the International Museum of the Reformation in Geneva. Switzerland borders France in the west, Germany in the north, Austria in the east, and Italy in the south. The country only measures 137 miles north to south and 216 miles east to west, but has landscapes varying from Alps to hilly meadows to rugged mountains and over 1,400 lakes. The national languages of Switzerland are German, French, and Italian, but you will also find English is widely spoken. Switzerland is comprised of 26 states or cantons, as the Swiss refer to them, with Bern as its capital. Not many cities have managed to retain their historic features quite as successfully as Bern. The old town of Bern has been entered into the list of UNESCO cultural world heritage sites and is known for its 10 miles of arcades, the longest weather-sheltered shopping promenades in all of Europe. The medieval air of this city with its many fountains, sandstone facades, narrow streets and historic towers is truly unique. The elevated rose garden above the bear pits and the platform of the cathedral tower offer the best views of the old town and the surrounding river Ara. The boutiques and small street cafes attract locals and tourists alike. The Zentrum Paul Klee, situated in the outskirts of the city, houses the most comprehensive collection of works by the artist Paul Klee. Bern is the seat of Switzerland's government. The Houses of Parliament rise above the city just a stone's throw from the railway station. In summer, the River Ara provides an opportunity for the ultimate swimming experience. Strong swimmers can drift down the Ara while enjoying a view of the Houses of Parliament. The Botanical Gardens are also located along the river, as is the zoo. When visiting the city, a trip to the bear pits to watch the bears gobble carrots is an absolute must. Lucerne, the gateway to central Switzerland, situated on Lake Lucerne, is embedded with an impressive mountainous panorama. Thanks to its attractions, its souvenir and watch shops, the beautiful lakeside setting, and the nearby mountain excursions, the town is a destination for travelers on their journey through central Switzerland. Complete with gable paintings, the covered medieval chapel bridge forms the centerpiece of Lucerne's townscape and is considered to be one of the oldest covered wooden bridges in all of Europe. A further landmark of the town is the Musigmauer, a wall which, with the exception of only one of its towers, has been preserved in its original, well-fortified state. The traditional and modern stand side by side effortlessly in Lucerne, as the town has also earned a reputation for innovative design. The futuristic Culture and Convention Center, designed by leading French architect Jean Nouvel, is one of the architectural highlights of the town. The nation of Switzerland was founded on the banks of Lake Lucerne, in the heart of the Alpine country. According to playwright Friedrich Schiller, national hero William Tell led Switzerland to freedom. The Lake Lucerne region is an outdoor paradise with beautiful Lake Lucerne stretching across it. While visiting, you'll want to board one of the five nostalgic paddle steamers and take a cruise of discovery. It's astonishing to observe such a variety of landscapes in such a short time. Every stop is a surprise.